to me, I love poetry, and it started when I was a kid with Dr. Seuss. And uh, I wrote a poem upon his death, which, as m many of you would know, was about 20 years ago. And here's that poem today. <clears throat> Have you ever seen a dead Dr. Seuss? He dropped dead from drinking the hooberry juice. He gagged and he wheezed and exploded his tongue. He coughed and he gagged and he exploded a lung. Along came some people to save Seuss's life. Some wharf snaddle doctors and also his wife. The cat and the hat and Horton too. The Grinch who stole Christmas and Cindy Lou Who. Get back, he said. Get back, I say. I've no room to breathe with you standing that way. I'm dying today, he said with elation, but I don't want to die of asphyxiation. Just take a step back and get me a drink. I'm planning my burial now. Let me think. You can put me in a suit, send my wife a bowl of fruit, but no hearse rides for Dr. Seuss. Put me in a pink caboose and pull it with a purple moose and from his antlers hang a noose. A dead Dr. Seuss on a moose noose caboose. <laughs> then dig a big hole deep under the sea where the one fish and two fish and blue fish will be. Dig it real deep with a snort crumple shovel. Drop me into the ocean and wave at my bubbles. That's what I'd do if I'm dying today, and I am, so go cram it and leave me. Ole! Hi, Bill Cott here for effinfunny.com. You know, tragically, People surf the internet for days without finding something funny. You don't have to worry about that. Visit effinfunny.com. It's effin' funny. I'm dying today.